we'd like to start off by welcoming you guys to New Tech and thanking you guys for coming to watch us. And um, if you guys ever seem to need a lift, you should come to Ski Lift. <laughs> Our strategies that we will show a nice video and cool career poster. Is it already out? Is it this one right here? Okay. Alright. Here's a video. Hold on. Roberts isn't very good at this. Where's the... Where's the... It should be down on that. Don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> Can't see it over here. Uh, a second. You're okay. I'm glad to know I'm not the only one who has problems with this. <laughs> <laughs> no, like it's not the... Oh, they get it. There it is. It's down at the very bottom. Okay. Got it. And now it's off the screen again. All right, what... Can it... You should be able to see it. Glitch. Come on. Okay, let me get a big screen and I'll plug it back in. Because I can't get to the button. All right. Let us do it, Mr. Roberts. Has yeah, if someone can come back here and do it, I just can't get the. See, it's not going full screen. You see it? What if you right click on it? Will it give you an yeah. option? Yeah. Nope. 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 Don't feel bad because it's it's not letting me preview it right now. Is there a? Did you publish it? You know. No. No, listen, you're all right. No stress. Dakota, come back here and there we go. Okay. It's just going back and forth from the one slide. Our estimated cost will be $69,753,313. We plan to get a loan from the city and since our closest competition is two hours away in Swiss Valley, Michigan, we have a better chance of bringing people to ski. We will have skiing, ice skating, concessions, training, a warm-up area, and many more exciting things. And how will we get two snow machines? We we'll have two snow machines that will continuously blow out snow. Our goal is uh, to make snow lift or ski lift, excuse me, a successful tourist attraction. That way, more people would want to come to Fort Wayne. The purpose of Ski Lift is to bring more people to Fort Wayne and, and to enjoy Ski Lift.
business will be profit. I-69 will be our biggest profit because it will bring more people to I-40. It's what Thomas is saying. Our location is less than two miles from I-69, so we can get our location and we get business there. As you see on that red dot, that is where we build our building from scratch, so we can just get a nice, school, a nice cold and ski lift building. Thanks, Thomas. Okay, buddy. There's a picture of, of I-69 for where Auburn Road is and where our location will be at. Thanks. Our building. On the right leg, we will have the main ski slope, so where you get sloped down, and that's the main one. The left leg is where our train will be, so you don't go to the main ski lift and have an accident. We don't want that to happen. Our right arm is where the heating place is, so you can warm up after you get done skiing. Our left arm is where the entry is, and our body is where we'll have our ice rink, so you can ice skate. The way we will make a profit, 46% of it will be from ticket sales. Like, so when they come to the door, they pay us our amount of money, and we get the money, and we share with the state. 23% uh, of it will be, will be for uh, rental, so they get rent equipment, and the others from concessions, etc. Welcome to Ski Lift. And remember, if you want to lift, come to Ski Lift. <laughs> So it wasn't clear to me until towards the end that this is an indoor facility? Yes. Is that right? Okay, because that answered my biggest question. Is, it, is this seasonal? Is this oh, year-round? I, I didn't catch it until the very end. end, so I'm thinking, how are you going to do you know? Um So my question is going to be finance-based. Okay. So you're <laughs> raising the capital to create this on a loan from the city. Yes. So you think the city's going to loan you $69 million? If we this? can... Uh, Show them how great we think ski lift will be. We do believe that they will. And Steve Dalton is still dynamics. I know the vice president needs to coach mm -hmm. me. He he has agreed to help us if we need anything. Okay. Okay. Sixty nine million dollars will not come from well, one source. Yeah, <laughs> okay. He's Just so you know, I, I think you need to look at a more. I, I think that's a good idea because it is a unique idea. And going to this, as I told the other group, looking to government based loans is always a smart thing to do. Small business loans. Um, lower interest rates, all those kind of things. You need to find a more diversified way to fund the startup for this project. You need to look for private investors um, as well as grants, loans, and so forth. Putting all your eggs in one basket is never a good idea. Okay, that would be my initial criticism for it. That being said, I think this is a really creative and great, unique idea. I haven't seen anything like